Coco Momo Ringo. Why so quiet, Coco Momo Ringo? Hello. Hi. Hi, plant lovers. This is Plant Lady Tess. And today it's February 15, 2021. And it's sunny outside. Although it's very cold. And I decided to make a video because my Mayana plants or my Coleus are really very beautiful. And I put them in a corner in an area where there's also a purpose. And I'm going to show you some uh, some uh, tips. The uh, for example, how to make it grow new leaves and be, be more bushy, and uh, some other things. But the main idea is I just want you to show my beautiful plants. Okay, so it is in this area. So I'm going to showcase how the sun would shine through this Mayana or this Coleus. I don't know, like, see? Wow, look at that. It's making like a very nice ruby color. And I made this bushy. Actually, this is an old plant. If you have seen my early video, my use my previous video, I got this last summer from a neighbor. It was already uprooted and I asked her like, can I have this and decided to plant this in this pot. And uh, it's growing nicely, although it's always thirsty and uh, would the leaves would look. But when the sun hits the leaves, yeah, it's very nice. So this area is near the window and uh, I decided to change the, uh, the, the, you know, the, the plant stand. It's a computer table actually. So because at the back here, I don't know, I show you my ginger and my, my ginger grow. So I'm going to show my ginger first see uh, they are growing and this one is not really it's still there I don't know maybe it's dead but this ginger has grown leaves and I know that uh, they need shade and uh, this one also see well my, my camera is under the table yeah see, yeah see uh, this is a turmeric, by the way. I just want to grow this just for fun. And then I decided to cut or propagate some Coleus or Mayana. Just so... This is my winter propagation, by the way. And they're growing because they're easy to grow. And I just like put them in a pot. But when they, they are really rooted... Oh, wow! Look at this. See? The sun hits the the stem of this ginger it's so pretty and we'll go to the other side okay it's over here see this is so beautiful when i wake up in the morning and there's the sun i would love to come here in this very very tight corner by the window see yeah and just be there for a while i would open the window a little bit and let the cold air come in and just uh, look at the leaves and be here for a while yeah look at these beautiful leaves and it's only from one small pot Oh, by the way, I made it look like this because I pinch, I pinch the new, the new bud to make it bushier. 
but right now I won't pinch them like this one see this one here this one is bushy also and this is a new arrangement I arrange it like this I'll make the camera farther so I can do uh, so you pinch this one here see if you pinch it it will grow new leaves yeah and will be bushier I noticed that uh, the leaves like uh, become smaller but they are bushier so I, I'm gonna pinch this because it's a bit high and then see I pinch uh, this one and then when this stem would be like uh, sturdy or get older I'm going to propagate it this summer to have new ones so I'm going to pinch this also uh, I'll pinch it like this you can pinch as much as you want some I pinch it already earlier and then I remember oh I better make a video about this and if you look at the it's only the the pot is very small see and uh, you have to watch out because after a day or two when it's sunny it's it will droop because it loves to drink water and the pot, my medium is like well drained medium so it dries out fast do you like it my beautiful beautiful coleosa this is my first time to take care of this and they're really really easy to grow uh, this is uh, my propagation but I have a small one here one of my winter propagation it's growing but I know it hasn't really rooted yet I'll just put it here yeah there and let's look at the back hiding behind her my turmeric which uh, grows so slowly but now at last it's growing I planted that last summer okay let's see do you like it let's look again my beautiful Mayana okay here let's drink it or let's drink its beautiful flowers take in the colors those lovely fuchsia purple leaves I might draw it or make a sketch later oh this is one of my older cactus I decided to put it here so I can see how the sun hits the the spike. Okay, here and then my other purple Mayana. It's beautiful also. I'm going to propagate more when uh, I have a uh, like maybe this one, this one. I might cut it in the summer this this part the, this one is a bit uh, picky because uh, this this one is really old see so that's why it's easy it, it grow so maybe I can cut from here and then it will grow okay. then also and this is my window area yeah the curtains are just like that okay. and here i'm going to show you this is a big pot with lots of seeds at the bottom i don't know maybe they should grow someday because i there's something here i buried something here yes it's there it's there see i can feel it i think it's a some kind of flower oh, okay and on top here on top of this computer table I put this yeah yeah 
So, may kalamansi. Some of my croutons. And, uh, my aglonima. Okay, this crouton, yeah, started to grow well. And, uh, I think it like this area. It has like, uh, let me see, see, some spots of yellow here. Yeah. Yes, and then I decided to put some snake plants at the corner. So, you, this plant won't be so bare like to, just to make up space i don't have a lot of space here okay so that's it for now for my mayana flower showing okay oh so nice so beautiful i love it okay thank you for watching my video I'll see you again soon and if you like my video like and share and don't forget to subscribe so you can see my new video again bye bye